The Ukrainian military said on Tuesday the previous 24 hours had been the deadliest of the war so far for Russian troops since Moscow launched its invasion almost a year ago. Ukraine increased its running tally of Russian military dead by 1,030 overnight. Reuters has been unable to verify that report, and Russia has also claimed to have killed large numbers of Ukrainian troops in recent weeks. Tallies of enemy casualties from either side are often seen as unreliable. But Kiev's assertion that the fighting was the deadliest so far fits descriptions from both sides of an escalating campaign of intense warfare. Here, Ukrainian soldiers in the Donetsk region are seen operating this Soviet-era Grad rocket system. The battle in the east comes amid reports of disorganization in Kyiv. President Volodymyr Zelensky in recent weeks dismissed several senior officials in moves seen as an effort to show Western allies he would take on corruption and prove himself a reliable steward for billions of dollars in desperately needed military aid. On Sunday, a politician from Zelensky's party said Defense Minister Oleksiy Reznikov would be replaced. A day later, the same politician said no changes would be made this week. Zelensky did not comment, but on Tuesday called for an end to, quote, rumors or any other pseudo-information, which he said could undermine unity in war. Whatever Reznikov's fate, he was seen welcoming his German counterpart in Kiev on Tuesday. German Defense Minister Boris Pistorius made the surprise trip a day after his government's Security Council approved the delivery of 178 Leopard 1 tanks to Ukraine. That decision comes atop Germany's choice last month to deliver the more modern Leopard 2 tanks to Kiev. Reznikov tweeted a picture of him and Pistorius posing with a scale model Leopard tank, writing, quote, the first Leopard 2 has arrived in Kiev. Minister, welcome. Pistorius also met with Zelensky. The Ukrainian leader said recent promises of heavy weapons from Europe and the United States could give Kiev, quote, parity, but not an advantage on the battlefield.